Sunday fun day 1999 bounce back yesterday was tough sledding for the Ben dog tough sledding for the Ben dog Benny here ghostpicksats.com the number one sports consultant in the business Sunday April 23rd I'll tell you I might need to send one up to the gods I might need to send one up to the gods I got smoked in the UFC yesterday what in the world my parlay my parlay ended up hitting yesterday in the UFC, but one of the fights wasn't available, you know, so it ended up just Montel Jackson and uh, Lucindo. But my uh, fight picks were off, you know, everyone, everyone. Where are we at? Where are we at? Nearing the end of April here, right? By far, this ended up being, this was my worst UFC event of the year thus far. Might end up being my worst UFC event of the year by year's end because I haven't I barely I barely rarely even lost any UFC events at all period this year you know this one I can safely say that I did absolutely I will own it you know Semmelsberger Brad Tavares Curtis Blades Curtis Blades was like nothing out there Sergey ate him you know I took the nah to two you know and he lost two it was just bad, bad yesterday. Bad. My free play lost two on uh, Tafa. And baseball. Braves, Astros, under eight and a half. And nine runs scored. <laughs> Step back. Take a breather. Time out. Time out. Time out. Breather alert. Okay. Come on. Step back. Take a breath. Relax, Kimo Zabi. Brush it off. Get back in the game. You're our top shooter. You're our top shooter. We need you out there. Okay? Thanks, coach. Let's get it. Go back into the game, Ben Dog. Go get him, Ben Dog. Lost on soccer yesterday. Leicester, Wolves, under two and a half. Lost on the Rangers, money line in hockey. I had a winner on the NBA, uh, on the Lakers. And then at MLB, Twins minus one and a half. Reds, Pirates, over nine. Lost, winner on the Padres, money line. Puts me at 47, 26, and one in baseball. Still 21 games in MLB on the year. Here's what I think. I believe today we're going to have a big bounce back day. I believe today we are in for a bounce back day. Sunday, fun day, $19.99. All jokes aside, right? I know I get up here, I joke, I have a good time, all that stuff. All jokes aside, I, I believe we are in for a bounce back day today. Finish this week strong. Come back Monday, new week, get ready to hammer. That is my pep talk. Sometimes we are the hammer, sometimes we are the nail, sometimes we are the bug, sometimes we are the windshield. Let's be the windshield today. Let's be the hammer. Let's not put the hammer to the windshield. That wouldn't work. You get what I'm saying? Speaking of hammer, Lionel Holston, Lakers minus four and a half and under 221 and a half. Gregory Brain uh, and Lucas 88. 888, excuse me. Shout out to the day winners. Lionel, Greg Brain, Lucas 888. Lakers minus four and a half and under 221 and a half. What are we doing today? How about you tell me your best bet of the day today? How about that? How about in the comment section, you tell me your top pick for Sunday. Hit me with some locks. Hit me with some locks in the comments today. You tell me your favorite pick of the day right here in the comment section. It is free to play. It is free to play. If you're new to my page, welcome. Take a second out of your day. Subscribe to the YouTube channel. Tap the bell. You'll get my videos as soon as they pop up. Follow me along over on Twitter as well, at Benny Bistro. Thumbs up in the video. Thumbs up for Benny. Share the video. We're going to keep rocking. We're going to keep rocking. Win or lose, rain or shine, we will be here rocking every single day. You feel me? The last five years, top dog every single day. Ghost Picks ATS. Let's go. Let's get a free play. 7, 10 p.m. Eastern time. New York Mets at the San Francisco Giants. Free play of the day. New York Mets. Money line. Tyler McGill on the mound. Not to be confused with slipping Jimmy McGill. Right? Just got done watching Better Call Saul. I'm all caught up now. It's over. They released the final season on Netflix. I was waiting for it for a long time because I wasn't caught up. I couldn't watch the, when it was happening. Slipping Jimmy McGill, Saul Goodman, one of my favorite characters of all time. This is not Slipping Jimmy McGill. This is Tyler McGill.
pitching for the New York Mets. He's three and one with a 3.00 ERA. He's nice, right? He's taking on Ross Stripling for the Giants tonight. Ross is 0-1, 7.30 ERA. I expect the Mets to handle business. Mets lost yesterday to the Giants. I think they come back and win today. This is the final game of a four-game series. Mets win game one, nine to four. Game two, Mets win seven to zero. Game three, Mets lose uh, uh, seven to four. And now we have game four tonight, prime time. Mets have been playing pretty well. Nice little eight wins out of the last 10 games. Seven and two, their last nine on the road. Giants got them yesterday. I'm taking the Mets to come back today. Then they come back home. Giants are allowing too many runs. Like the Giants offense is, can perform okay. But they can't keep the opposing team from scoring. That's what it looks like to me. I'm going with the Mets. Free play today, New York Mets money line. Also, dubs at home. Warriors minus seven and a half at home. That seems how to be the, uh, how the series is looking. Kings when the Kings are at home. Warriors when the Warriors are at home. Right? We certainly have a battle on our hands in this series. I like the Warriors minus seven and a half. Let's go. Let's be the hammer today. Let's be the windshield. Let's not smash the windshield with the hammer. Okay? Sunday Funday, $19.99, pinned right here to the top of the comment section. We've got a nice slate lined up. Bounce back slate today. As always, good luck. God bless. Right on, baby. Cheers.